Here is an old hugger fan. I don't know if this is a can arm. I mean, it most likely is because everything around here is can arm. But to be honest, I'm not sure where the switch is. Assuming it's that one over there and they're both seem to be in the on position here. Unless they're upside down. Let's give this a pull. Oh yeah. Right on. You can see as compared to the newer can arm Zephyrs, motor housing looks just a little different. Almost looks like it's wider in the middle. Got the moon shaped brackets or whatever. Uh, this this fan looks like it's a little out of clock here. Looks like this blade got smacked into. It's got like zero pitch. <laughs> this one too might have got something's going on with it. it. Doesn't have very much pitch. The rest of them are fine. Anyways, I don't know which one's the speed switch here. Oh, and it's that one. So there's high speed. Whirls up a nice storm. Oh yeah, she she actually gives her pretty good. Dust flying off of it. I presume it doesn't get used too much. Wow, there's like zero airflow. I kid you not. feeling anything. Bearings seem to be making a little bit of noise. This is actually my friend's house looking after his dog while he's away. I've seen this thing on a couple of times and it's always usually used in updraft. I'm surprised it's in downdraft right now and I can totally see why they use it in updraft because it just doesn't seem to move anything in downdraft. That's weird. I'm pretty sure three of the blades still have pitch. Anyways, we'll click her down to low. Yeah, those bearings are definitely making some sounds. If you can hear it there. Nice and tight on the ceiling anyway. Yeah, this thing's actually pretty beat. I didn't notice how bent up the blades were. Oh, <laughs> this one's actually got reverse pitch going on. I don't know, you probably can't really tell. Yeah, see? Pretty tough to tell, but it's actually pitched the wrong way, so that blade will be sucking up while the others are trying to blow down. This one's just got like zero pitch. Same with this one. Oh, there's, there's a wee bit there. Oh, and this one's mega reverse pitched. I didn't notice how mangled these blades were. That one's got somebody's hand in it a few times when it was in updraft. Anyways, I switched it already. Yep, go to high. Can I shut this thing off? I don't really know what he's got going on here, but looks to have a humidifier fan just going. I'll shut that thing off for now so we can hear these bearings. Hear me? 
medium. Here's low. And we'll shut her down. Yeah, there's two other ceiling fans in this house. But they're not really old or anything special, so... make videos of them. Well, plus one's in his bedroom and I'm <laughs> sure as crap ain't gonna be waltzing on into his bedroom and making a video of his fan. Yeah, I'm just looking at this. These blades here. Look at that, eh? see someday maybe I'll ask him if he wants me to straighten them out for him but to be honest I don't think he really knows I collect fans but he's, he's seen my sheds and he's seen my excessive number of them so maybe he has an idea <laughs> and that's it for that one I'll leave out I better put it back on down draft that's what he had it on turn his little and back on. Well, there's the one in his bedroom. It's just a random newer cat arm, not too interesting. And there's this hunter in the kitchen here. I mean, I've seen hundreds of videos of these on the internet, I think, so you won't even bother making a video of it. But I do have another week of checking up on his place, so I guess if you really want to see it that bad, let me know and maybe I'll make a video of it. Anyways, thanks for watching.